Here's her coffee. Thank you. Oh, and Kiara wants you to wear that jacket for the interview. Can't even pick up my own clothes. Wait, hold up, hold up. Your newest project is about to drop, and it's your birthday weekend? Oh, you out here living your best life, yeah. <laughs> T, I don't know. This birthday, it just feels different. Honestly, I don't even know how to feel. <sighs> you know your girl, Kiera, I'm sure she gonna make this birthday about her. Playing some event, marketing, PR, you know her, the BS. I hope that changes, because this is a big album for you. And it's kind of dope that it falls on your birthday weekend. And I guess I can't lie, that is kind of lit. Shit, it's gonna be a crazy promo on tour season if this how they coming? Just for the interview? Come on, they know what's up. Think about it, T. This is my first album in six years. These new artists, man, they don't know nothing about anticipation. I'm gonna have these hoes fiending for me. Facts. <laughs> you that nigga, boss. <laughs> That's what y'all say. <laughs> yeah, you that nigga. But boss, I gotta get you inside. Let me get your door. All right, Ray, let's do it, bro. All right. Put this ugly-ass jacket on. Can't even pick up my own clothes. <sighs> How do you act? Will, 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 you can make a comeback. Will, 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 Will. Will, Will, Will. Oh, my God, you're amazing. Will, I'm sorry. Will, 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 Will. Will, Will, Will. What'd you say? Stop out, what'd you say? Stop out, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Let's move. Well, come on, well, don't worry about all that. Come on, come on. Come on, we gotta move. Like, come on, we gotta move. Like, come on, we gotta move. Yo, I'm just trying to figure out where she got that from. Ronnie, bro, bro, you're not gonna believe this. Nigga, I just heard the paparazzi ask about me and Jordan. Miss, what? Stop. Ain't nobody know about you and Jordan. What made you tripping? Bro, I'm telling you, I know what I heard, and I heard the paparazzi say it. Damn, what about man. you and Jordan? I heard it. They forgot my pH water, man. What's going on? Bro, focus. Well, okay, my bad, daddy. Look, what's up, man? It's good to see you. Look, you know I'm here for you, and you know why I'm here. I'm here to get you booked. Laid and paid, baby, man. Just stay focused, man. Nobody know about you enjoy. You good, man. Cancel the interview. Cancel it. Ain't in the mood for Camila and her antics. You know she's still mad at me for ghosting her way back uh, in 05. So what you got caught with your pants down, like, literally? Shit. God damn. You ain't playing everywhere, bro. This is worse than Kevin Hart. So we making jokes about my career now? No, man. Just... Just wait, wait, man. Just, just breathe, daddy. Just breathe. I can't even deny it. And that's just the business. That's just the business, man. Who put the camera in the room? You're right. How did the camera get in here? It's a mystery afoot. They want some super ninja CIA spy type shit. I wonder what kind of camera that was. Rodney, how you so nonchalant about this? Well, first of all, for starters, it's not me. Wow. Um, secondly, all press is good press, daddy, you know. You must have forgot about Dick. His last album was bomb and it still flopped. Oh, you got a point about there. Look, you got five minutes to get ready for this Camilla Trail interview. Look, Daddy, you'll be good, man. I'll see you out there. Today on the show, we have the multi platinum selling heartthrob of our generation, the amazing and now controversial Will Clay. Uh, thank you for having me, Camilla. You know, it's always dope coming down here checking you out at Epic. How was your first, right? Listen, you know we have to put that into perspective for the people. You were my first major interview as a journalist. Yeah, I mean, what else could I have been talking about? Well, let's cut to the chase. You're back with a new album, What's Next? It's slated to be your comeback project, but critics are all wondering whether or not it will live up to the success of your previous releases. I mean, I know it's a lot going on in the media as of this morning, but I yeah. could take it. You know, and I think my fans are going to be thoroughly pleased with what we got going for them on the album. You sound very confident about your new album. Well, I mean, my pops always told me, even if you got to smile through bad situations, just smile and get through them. Speaking of difficult situations, you were recently caught on tape with the pop star Jordan Holmes. How does your girlfriend, Kira Kay, feel about that? She can't be handling that well. Camilla, huh? You, we're right in. You, we going there already, huh? I can't hold back with my first, right? Listen, Camilla. <laughs> I love Kiara, mm -hmm. always will, and that's that. So my new single, Ain't Just Sex, I'm actually performing it for the first time tonight in Philly. So you actually should come through. Everybody's invited to come and check it out. Well, are you deflecting? No. no. Just talking about what matters. Right. So, baby? How are you? Good. Let's welcome Kiara K, publicist to the stars to the show. So you are saying this happened? No, what we're saying is we want to focus on the album. 
Not the negativity. Okay. So when was the first time that you cheated on Kira? Was this recent? Camila, can we focus on the album? Please. Why don't you just tell the truth? Camilla, it didn't happen. Okay, he did not cheat on me. I know Will. That video was old, long before he and I even got together. Well, why don't you just admit that you made a mistake? We all know you're not perfect, even though you pretend to be. I asked you not to discuss this. I have not cheated on Kiara. Now, please, can we get back to the interview before I turn into a meme on this show? And we'll be right back after this commercial break with the Camilla Trill Show. Camilla, what the hell is wrong with you? You set me up. I told you that nothing was off the table. Stop trying to people, please, and just admit, not just to her and your fans, but to yourself. Look, Camilla, we're trying to give you an opportunity to fix this like a professional. Or, if you'd like for me to step out of character, I can drag you across your little gossip show. Oh, excuse me. You're threatening me for telling the truth about Will's foolery? Everyone knows that Will has been cheating on you for years, Kira. The whole excuse industry you. knows I'm it. I'm like, come on, she lying, Key. Uh, she wanted to Cheating with who? This is business, and ratings are going to be ratings, whether or not you want to pretend that the whole world didn't see him and Jordan on tape. Well, let's not R. Kelly this situation. Just tell the truth, Will. Listen, Camilla, what I do and what I don't do don't got shit to do with you. All right. right. But please don't forget who I am. You're delusional. Oh, okay. You're everybody's business. You're a public figure, and you screwed up royally. We're about to come from a commercial. Places, everybody. Either you talk or you leave. Either way, I'm going to be reporting your news, Mr. Perfect. Okay, cool. Actually, Camilla, I got a story for you. Three, mm -hmm. Kiss my ass. Two, oh, word. Camilla Trill, wanna be. And we're back from our commercial break with Kira K. Girl, let's talk. Let's talk. Hey, Dad. Hey, son, how you doing? I heard about what's going on. Happy birthday to you. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, William Clay Gregory III. <laughs> Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. you. <laughs> we love you, Will. <laughs> we saw your interview on the TV, and I thought you said that Camilla girl was your friend. She seemed a little rude if you ask me. No, nah, she was just doing her job. I mean, honestly, everybody wanted her to go harder than that on me, so I think I came out pretty well, good. Well, anyway, it's just uncomfortable for us to see you go under so much pressure on national TV. Oh, yeah, speaking of pressure, well, um, how's Kiara, you know, dealing with all this? You know her, handling business and cleaning up the mess. Oh, all right. Well, tell her I asked for her. I gotta go check with her Mac <laughs> Oh, all right, baby. Hey, hey, Will, can you still hear me? Oh, yeah, I'm still here, Pops. Look here now, I, I know you're dealing with something I can't even understand. You know, fame and, and life in the limelight. You got everyone up in your ear, all up in your business. That could be overwhelming now. Now just remember your foundation and put your trust in God. Thank you, Dad. I needed to hear that right about now. You always got a home here, all right? You ever need to come back here, you need a break? And leave them pop star bunnies alone. <sighs> okay, Dad. And don't forget, think about what I said. I love y'all too. I know y'all don't heard what happened on Camilla Trill today. Will Clay, your boy, dropped the ball on live television and Camilla pressed him about him cheating on his fiance with Jordan Holmes. Embarrassing. Mm. <sighs> Let me tell you, we got all the tea today. Totally, totally unacceptable yes. and embarrassing. Uh -huh. But what do you expect from a guy like Will Clay? You just don't like him. You know, no, it's not that I don't like him. It's mm -hmm. just that, like I said, I judge people by their actions. Yes. Okay, and his action is showing time and time again mm -hmm. that he's a piece of shit. Dang. That's it, he's a piece of shit. And I'm not surprised, okay? You surprised? I gave him a little bit more credit than you're giving him. Nah, I'm, I'm not surprised at all. Okay. All right, what, what, I, what I, I am surprised is, is that Kiara's coming to his defense. Like, why is she coming to his defense when he cheated on her? Yeah, that was a little, uh... That's crazy to me. I... So, black women, we do have to stop doing this. We have to stop putting ourselves as the sacrifice in front of black men. She should have just let him and left his ass out there and let him do whatever he needed to do and catch that L. Apparently. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm no more authority, mm -hmm. okay? 
But I can call out. You got your own. Definitely. I can call out <laughs> low character when I see it. Very true. All right. Now, Kiara needs to leave him instead of coming to his defense. Black men don't cheat. That's what they say. Unfortunately, this one did because they got the footage to prove it. Baby, I don't seen that thing, and it's crazy. But to be honest, this is probably a publicity stunt that Kiara has set up in order to help promote his new album. Because no, that's no, what we're all talking no, about no, now. No, 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 no. It's, it's not a publicity stunt, okay. okay? All right. What do you expect from Will? The heart thrive. I gave him a right? more credit than you give him. No, trust me. He's not going to be faithful to anyone but himself. Dang. It's just, it is what it is. Well, See look. See things for what they are. It's what it I, is. Look, I couldn't really tell if it was him. <clears throat> it was kind of like that, you know. It was my... him. Okay. I guess. Look, we got the tea every day, all day on TKA. See you guys next time. I'm your girl, Mona. And I'm your boy, Justin. Justin don't like Will Clay, but we out here. Love you guys. Peace. Okay. Check it out. What? What y'all think? Think about what? Why are we here? What is this? This is my inspiration for my next video by Ain't Just Sex. Came down here and I was looking at it and I'm like, this the direction I'm trying to go. Okay, first of all, we need to be focusing on getting in front of this Camilla Trail interview and this Jordan Holmes video. This is my way of getting in front of it with the music. I'm telling you, it's doper than it looks. Ryan, what you think? I don't know, man. Okay. I kind of like the smoke, baby oil, girls. Nigga, nigga, I just got in trouble for that. Now, come on, that's a slap in the face to the fans if I did something like right. that promoting sex. I'm thinking now, imagine it, lit up, electric. Come here, I'm telling you, Will Clay. Okay, this is cute. Glitz in your glam and your lights. We need to focus on the real, okay? You can hunt all the little groupies that you want. That's our deal, that's fine. But now it's in the public eye and you embarrassed the hell out of me on national Gee, TV. I didn't know nobody was gonna record it, come on. Oh, so now it's the person that take this problem? You were sloppy. And Jordan, of all people, how in the hell am I supposed to damage control this? Uh, I don't know. Take a picture. Mm -hmm. Show these people that we're still together. Hey, I'll post this. Tag Camilla's show. Maybe I'll take care of some of the backlash from today's debacle. In the meantime, call your car, go home, wash the smoke off your face, and dress like you'd like the party. Okay? No, man, you feeling like all that. You, you don't have a choice right now. This album has to pop, and you've destroyed all of my footwork for you to bust a nut. 
Okay, you're gonna shake hands and you're gonna kiss as much ass as you have to. Oh, so now I'm just a monkey in a cage. You gotta do what you gotta do. You're the one that messed up. Wow. Let's go. Look, I get it. But it was already out there. You should have just got ahead of it instead of acting like we ain't all see you bunny hopping with Jordan. Girl, you know that wasn't me. But who I look like? Look, stop reaching for everyone's approval. If I can love you all these years, so can everyone else. Are uh, you real funny? Now, can you please stop sticking your thing everywhere? I mean, clearly not everywhere. Please, you wish. Maybe. Anyway, bye, William. Bye, Shade. Thank you for calling me. Hey, y'all. Yo, what up? Look, I just got off the phone with Will not too long ago, and I was thinking that we can go by and surprise him. Okay. You know, the proper rice is probably still on him. Sounds good, let's bounce. Uh, whatever we do, I'm gonna need one of y'all to spot me because my pocket's on lean right now. I'll support I guess, bro. See, what I don't understand is how you bagging all these women, but you don't never got no money. Look, when you look this good, it's never a problem, okay? okay. All right, I'm gonna close that. All right, I'm gonna get the car. What's the word on you? You want to flirt on you? You might just skirt on you. You like the car. You got all the Amazing. What you do? Send out a casting call for the industry's most smug and elite? It's my birthday. Do I even know any of these people? Or are they your little money team? Cut it out, Will, okay? I'm doing you a favor. I filled this room with the industry's deepest pockets for you. The least you can do is be grateful and play your role. Now, turn it on and stop acting like a little boy. No, there's a man in there somewhere. Let's go. Hi, right, honey. How can I help you? Hey, how's it going? What's going on? Yeah, uh, check it for our list. Yo, check it for Molly Mall. Let me see that. Come on. Hey, 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 hey. No, Nick, who is you doing? No. Yeah, Tom? Uh, no. Chardet. No. Excuse me? There must be some mistake. There's no mistake. Your name is not on the list. Thank you. I'm sure if you just check with Will or Kier, I don't then... need to check with Will. Your name is not on the list. Excuse me? Tao, I got this. Sir, my friend, he tried to be nice to you, but I'm not the one. So if you just please step aside and make a way for us, we won't make a scene for you and your bougie guests. Okay? You can make a scene if you want to, but you're only going to be embarrassing yourselves. Now please, take your ratchet friends to the side and shuffle back to the hood where you came from. Don't you know what I'm talking about? Listen, Will's next album is already sounding like another classic, and it's projected to be his best-selling project thus far due to the anticipation. With Will's musical achievements and his recent decision to move over into film, it's perfect timing for Will to be the face of some major brands, both domestically and internationally. Right, babe? <laughs> no. How lucky I am to have you. Mm, very. <laughs> so, about those mumble rappers. They do the right? most. It's just so good of you. They really need some help. Excuse me. I, I got someone to take care of real fast. Have another glass. What's going on down here? Sir, these people are trying to crash your party. These but people you talking about right here are my best friends. Who, do, who, who put you in charge? Sir, your fiance left me in charge of letting the people in the event. She left strict instructions to only let the people on the list in, no exceptions. My fiance? Yes, your fiance. Man, who your South African ass out the way? Come on. I'm from West Africa. This no, come way. on. I think come this morning to be treated like that. Yo, keep talking. I'm from the continent. Why? That nigga from Mississippi, he ain't came from North South Africa. 
So you wasn't going to tell us about your birthday party? Shonda, I didn't know nothing about this. I swear to God, Kiera would have this. But I'm so sorry she ain't invite my people. Mm -hmm. So we ain't bougie enough to be a part of your shindig? Oh, no, we ain't important enough oh, to be Oh, man, you know it ain't like that, dude. Come on, we weren't even invited. Let's go. Bro, town, it ain't like that. Whoa, 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 slow your roll. Look, it's your birthday. I'm going to make an exception, all right? I love you. Well, we've been your friends for, like, your whole life. And you gonna treat us like this. Sade, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't know nothing about this. But since y'all here, let's just have a good time. Yo, let's squash this. We're here to celebrate. Happy birthday, Will. Thank you, bro. Willie, Will, baby boy, it's your birthday. Hey, come on, make some noise. Listen, Kiara needs you. It's an investor. It can't wait, all right? <laughs> Talk to you later, man. Family, what's up? Oh, no, niggas, let it hell. How y'all late, man? What's going on, baby? <laughs> Get this, oh, police, police, help me. Tom, baby, it's good to see you, man. Uh-huh. Char Ooh, Sade, what's up? What? <laughs> Listen, no? Who was I invite? <laughs> Kiara told me about three hours ago. I'm talking shoes, a whole line of clothes. I mean, yeah, right. I actually need to exist. talk to you real fast for just two seconds. Hey, baby, week. where'd you go? My new friends, Matt and Tara, wanted to meet you. Nice to meet you, brother. The way you came up out of the struggle. My wife and I are big fans of your music. Yes, it's very inspiring. <laughs> the struggle? <sighs> Never mind. Look, if you guys don't mind just giving us a quick second, we can talk to Kira real fast. Sure. We'll get more drinks in the meantime. Okay, don't go too far, okay? Bottoms up. Will, what the hell are you doing? That new couple you just pulled me away from want to get in the Will Clay business. Kiera, why weren't my friends invited? My assistant forgot to send their invitation. Oh, Listen, they'll get over it. This isn't a party for them anyway. Oh, that's how you feel about my best friends? Look, it is what it is. Okay, they're cute little common folk. But we're a different breed, a different class, and we need to act like it. That's bullshit. Me? Y'all think he was being shady? Mm -hmm. I know it looked a certain way, but I don't think she was being shady on purpose. Speak of the devil. Yeah. Hey, hey, how you doing? <laughs> oh, man. So glad you all could make it. Yes. Today. So sorry. Right. Well, we wouldn't miss it for the world, but only if we had an invite. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. I heard about that. I know you guys are like his family. No, we are family. Unlike you, a gold that can troll. Oh, I don't like what you're insinuating. Uh, I'm not insinuating, I'm stating. Just stop being fake all the time and just admit you don't bang what it says you claim. You want to keep it real? I'm here for Will and Will only. And I have no interest in you three stooges being around me. It breeds jealousy when the people around you are succeeding and you're stuck at your little nine to five. Charlie, can you please do me a favor and snatch this drawn weave up? Yeah, okay. okay. I'm going to let her live off Will's hard work and success for another year. She'll be riding more coattails before the night's end. That's what she's good at. <laughs> hey, Will, Will, man, come on, yeah. Yo, I got Guess what? I just had an epic conversation with Chuck Sturman. Chuck Sturman? Y'all know the producer? Guess who he wants to be the lead in his next film? Who? Oh Will Clay. Yeah. 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 I can't believe it, y'all. And Rodney, I gave you your number, so make sure you keep your head on the school for this phone call. You already know, baby. You already know, so this is the perfect time for a shot. Let's hey. go. Oh, yeah. uh, I think it's a great idea, Will. Hey, yo, by the way, I got the weed, all right? Weed? I got that very most sour diesel. Oh, you got it? Look, don't get carried away, Mom. You don't want to offend Miss Queen Carrie. Oh, I'm sorry, you Majesty. You don't have to. You know what? Cheers. Oh, all right. Well, here's to another great year of success for my best friend, Will. May you continue to love me. Together! Yeah. Never leave your side, yeah, yeah. Looking in your eye, yeah, yeah. Feel like I can fly, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. May God always keep you, I pray. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I pray that you not go astray. Oh, no, 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 no. No, I won't leave you alone. I put that word on my life and I promise you, me, ho, we gon' be okay. Mix up earlier with the doorman and you know her. 
Y'all still love me though, right? We good. Just promise me one thing. What's up, bro? No matter if you're halfway around the world, we always on that guest list. Y'all was top guest list, man. Just know I'm a clown, you in that group chat, oh, boy. Just don't man. get in your feelings. I'm like, we're gonna schedule another dinner. What you gonna be for? <laughs> I got you. Hi, y'all. Well, I'm going to go ahead and uh, check that group chat because I'm going to send all the pics. You know, the photographer got y'all looking lit. Make sure that y'all get home, please. Got you. All right. Tal, you make sure this. Get home. Shut up. <laughs> you know, you know he's been drinking. Tal's the designated driver. Stop playing with me. Bye, Shade. Woo, Kiara, we had such an amazing time. You know, Matt and I don't get out too often, but it was such a, <laughs> it was such a pleasure hanging out with you and your family tonight. Honey, I mean, we have to hang out with Kiara and Will more often. <laughs> they will keep me young. Ooh, it looks like we got the sparks flying. Yo, Kiara, if I were you, I'd get him home before that whiskey wear off, if you know what I mean. Mm. Get it in, y'all. <laughs> Come on, Matthew. Our driver's waiting outside. Look, look forward to hearing from us soon, okay? Okay. I'm gonna get home soon, Ouch. guys. Tonight was amazing, all right? Oh my God, I'm so excited. So now we just need to focus on promoting the album, the tour, oh, and dodging the press. We don't need any more mess. I booked some studio time tomorrow, It'll be a little bit late, but just stick to the plan with the producers, okay? No, nah, for real, why you ain't invite my friends? <laughs> Baby, I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm not over this. It won't happen again. You say that stuff, but you be lying. You love I'm a lot. I'm not lying. You lie. Yeah, you love a lot. No, I don't. <laughs> but you don't mind if I lie and it benefits you. Come here. Stop. I just said I wasn't in the mood. I didn't ask if you were in the mood. Mm -hmm. Come here. That's your fire, right? Hell yeah. <laughs> but who laid down that reference? That is Stacy G. We've been working with her for a while now. You want me to go get her out of Studio B? Yo, is she signed? Because if she ain't signed, I think I'm gonna need to get her for my new label. Yo, I've been telling her that you would love her style. She reminds me of you. Oh, <laughs> let me go get her. All right. Well, baby girl Stacy G. Stacy, oh. it's the homie Will Clay. <laughs> Stacy, I just played him the track that you referenced for him. Yo, I'm telling you, she's the next Lauren Hill. Yo, this is crazy. It is so amazing to meet you. Like, I grew up listening to you, so for you to be standing here is insane. You're like one of my greatest inspirations. Well, first of all, grew up. Come on, don't make me feel so old. How old are you anyway? 18. OK. Maybe I am old. Yeah. <laughs> what was I doing when I was 18? What, yo, I think I was just signing my first deal. Yo, Stacy plays the hell out of the guitar, too. And that's how I got plugged to her. I wanted a guitarist, and I was looking for a lady, so everybody recommended Stacy. OK, so you play the guitar, and you sing. Question. You trying to be a musician, or you trying to be an artist? An artist, for sure. OK, OK. You got any more original music I can hear? Well, I've been producing on my iPad since I was like 15. <laughs> and Mel has been working me for months now. Stacy, I know you just didn't tell me you've been producing on the iPad. Yeah. Bro, man, times have truly changed. For real. I got an idea though. Stacy G, how would you feel about opening up Will Clay on my new world tour? Hey. And possibly signing to my new label. What? <laughs> Hell yeah, I'm with all of that. Okay, that's what I like to hear, but I'm gonna tell you this though. 
I ain't gonna go easy on you. Cause that just ain't the Will Clay way. You better not go easy, cause it wasn't nobody easy on you. You feel me? No, really. <laughs> well, look, I'm here for all of it, but I was wondering, would you be willing to sing the song that I referenced for Rel as a duet instead of by yourself? Stacy G and Will Clay. Yo, I think I'm here for that. Let's go cut it now. All right. You gotta show me all the rips and runs in the door. Ooh, ew, yeah. Okay, so they hit me up this morning. It is a music charity event. Not a priority. Short term, instant cash. I've told you that. Okay, all right. Yo, yo. Yo, y'all killed it. Y'all killed it. Yes, sir. <laughs> you know her. Baby, Easy. look, I wanted you to meet us. Uh, Who is this? And what is she doing here? Yo, this is my homegirl, Stacy. I mean, come on, she's exactly what we're looking for. Hi. I can't believe I'm in the same room with Will Clay and Kiara K. Uh, and we can't believe we in the same room as Stacy G. 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 Oh, stop, stop. That's embarrassing. <laughs> yeah, I told you, look, we got to sign her. I mean, that wasn't bad. I mean, she does have some raw talent here. With a little direction, you could be somebody. Make sure to get information, okay? I got you. You'll get it before you leave. Come on, let's go. Come talk to me, baby. Come on. <laughs> All right, you can come too. Right. She was good, baby. Check this out. I got okay. a little gift for you. Oh, is it the new Tesla? Hey guys, what's up? To all my homebodies out there, thank you for holding me down and having my back. Because these last couple weeks have been crazy. People have been calling out my name. Uh, paparazzi is harassing me and my family everywhere I go about rumors and lies. Okay. I just want to set the record straight. Okay, Will and I are just friends. The footage is not recent, and he's actually like, he's like a mentor, and there hasn't been anything between us. Look, I respect him and Kiara's relationship, and I expect y'all to do the same. What? <laughs> okay, on another note, my single's coming out. What? Babe, you're welcome. <laughs> oh, how did you do that? I got my sources. That's what I'm talking about. My baby, Kiera K. Ooh, ooh, you come here, Kiera K. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> now come on, let's go, uh, K. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we're closed. Perfect timing. What you doing here? I'm vindicated, baby. I see. Things must be going good if you're doing surprise pop-ups on your friend. Come on, Sade. I said I'm sorry. Mm, so you just came to kick it, or you want to apologize for the other day? I just came to talk to you. Need a little bit of advice on something, and I know you're one of the few people in my life who are actually going to keep it 100 with me. All right. What's up? You know how rough stuff been going lately, and... I just been thinking about getting older as an artist and what I'm gonna do after this. And I know I'm not too old yet, but I've been doing this for a long time and it's really starting to take a toll on me. You and your feelings again, talking about taking a break from your music. Is that what you really wanna do? Not all the way. Look, check it out. So I met this artist named Stacy G and she is cold. She's lit when I tell you she just got the it factor and it dawned on me. Maybe I could develop other artists. I'm more than just my voice. So what y'all gonna be like, a Rick James and a T. Marie? <laughs> you got jokes. I said, girl, you always playing too much. No, I'm gonna sign her. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna develop her, write with her, create a classic album, and then bow out as Will the Artist and welcome Will the Executive. It's ambitious. I like it. You know I'll support you and stuff. <laughs> Thank you. So, is Kiara cool with this? What you think about last night? What, sex? No. Stacy G at the studio. Why are we talking about this now? I'm ready to go upstairs around two. Cause it's just been on my mind heavy and I'm gonna make sure we lock her down before we lose her. Look, she was good and all, Will, but we need to focus on you and getting you locked into this long-term deal. That's money on the table now. I just think about it. Stacy could be the key to getting our record label off the ground and I could retire and maybe just transition into working on her. And me and you. 
Guess what we can do? We can start a family. You talking about retiring and becoming a producer? Child, please. You need to worry about singing and let me and Rodney worry about your career. All wow. right? I'll see you later, family man. Wow. Well, good night to you, too. So Kiara isn't cool with it? <laughs> Not the way she was talking. What would you do without her? Uh, I don't know. I've been with Key and Rod for so long, it's like I couldn't even imagine my life or my career without him. All you need to do what's best for you. And sometimes Rodney and Kiara don't have your best interests ever. <laughs> Why are you so dumb, Sade? You're literally one of the most consistent people in my life. All your life. Okay, hey, best friends tell each other the truth. And I don't want you waking up one day and just realizing that your purpose is right in front of you. You are more than a beautiful man, I can say. So you think I'm beautiful? I always <laughs> wanted a tender moment with your pretty ass. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. Rodney, how you doing, man? Thank you so much. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Oh, the good stuff, huh? Mmm. Hey, uh, Steve, you mind if I get another round of that? Oh, yeah. Feel free to oh. indulge. Yeah, damn right. Especially you, Will. I'm gonna take this old bottle home. <sighs> so, we want to commend you all. Will, Rodney, and Kiara for all of your hard work and achievements. And your new world tour that we believe will be your best yet. Thank you so much. It's shaping up to be pretty lit. We all know by now that initially we had some doubts onto whether or not we could get a good return from an R&B album that seemed to speak to only a certain demographic. But ultimately, ultimately, um, you surpassed those expectations with the creation of this new album. Your support means everything to us, Steve. Thank you so much. So about these contracts, because that's why we're here tonight, right? That is why we're here, right? <laughs> <laughs> See, that's what I like about you. You put your business first. Ah, uh, you know. <laughs> so, let me introduce you to Braxton McCall. He is our bright new executive that was brought over from the merger with BCMA. And Key, he was at the birthday party, right? Yeah, he was. So this is more like your second introduction. Thought I recognize you, man. Good to see you Good again. Good to see you. Thank you, Steve. Will. My sole purpose is to strengthen our partnership with a deal that benefits us all and takes your career to the next level. So, I'll be teaming up with Kiera and Rodney behind the scenes to ensure that dream. I think you'll be happy with our very lucrative offer that far exceeds any offer that any R&B artist would receive in today's climate. This agreement would take effect once you first step on stage for your new world tour this summer. We want you to know how much you're valued, Will. Damn! Um, I mean, well, yes, uh, this is a good start. <laughs> Will. I mean, it's a nice number, but it's a 360. I don't do those. Look, I totally understand. Look, 360s get a bad rap, but I still think you can see the benefits of this. Will, baby, no. everyone in this room knows how amazing you are and all of the great talents that you possess. Braxton and Steve want to make you the face of their new merger and a major brand worldwide. Our first priority is gonna be getting you moved from the East Coast to LA where BMCA's finest agents are located and getting you into the new artist development program. Wait, what? I just moved back. Y'all want me to go back and do what? I know y'all don't think Will Clay going through anybody's artist development program and actually, did he ever tell y'all that? I'm actually not even sure that I wanna be an artist anymore. I kinda wanna get on the back end and do some producing. Will. Anyway. Will, I'm confused. I, I just... Do you mind if we just step hey, into the hallway real quick I second. know what I want. Let's go in the hallway wait, wait, and talk look, I know what I want. Okay, we'll be back. I don't know why y'all had to pull me out the meeting, being all dramatic. Right. Somebody want to tell me what the hell was that in there? That was Mr. Gregory over here wants to leave all this money on the table so he can start his new record label with his muse whoa, for the day, Stacy G. Hold on. Wait, nobody thought it was important to tell me that before we walked in there? Think about it, y'all. We don't need them. The three of us, we know the game, but we also know music. Add that with Stacey G, yo, we got magic. Well, I get it, but <laughs> it's a lot of commas in there, man. Yeah, like, a lot of commas. Can we do both? Well, that's chunk change compared to our work. Think about it. If we get ownership, we're not living off the advances that the label giving us. It's a big picture move here, bro. Come this on. Crazy. Look, you know what? It's my career. Y'all got to do what I tell y'all to do because I pay y'all. I write the checks. So this is what I want. This is what okay. I'm going to get. Go in there and make it happen. That's all I'm Relax. saying. Relax. You getting a little worked up? 
Calm down. No. Let's talk about this. Okay, all right, all right. Listen, Key, you go in there, make something up, tell me. Make you something up. <laughs> you guys. Oh my God. You you go home and go get some rest and look. We'll reconvene tomorrow and we'll figure this out, okay? Rodney here, this is deeper than what y'all know. I made a promise to my grandfather many years ago at his grave that I would never settle and that I would always remember that all things are possible through Christ. And y'all gotta make it happen. Okay, okay, okay. I'll handle it. And I'll make sure we take care of what you need first and foremost, okay? Let's fix this. But listen, this is what I find interesting. I always took Will Clay to be selfish. Like, he's like uh, a pretty boy. Because he is. <sighs> yeah, he, he definitely is. But it looked like he wanted to do something a little bit more than sing, apparently. Okay, okay. You know, my source tells me that he didn't turn down a multi-million dollar deal in pursuit of doing his own thing independently. Okay, I see you, Will Clay. I'm not going to turn down no bag like that, but it's okay to each his own. But listen, maybe he wants to change directions and not be so egocentric. You know, maybe he might be on his Nipsey hustle, you know, inspiring everybody for change. You know, he might be different now. I doubt it. Mm. You asked me, that was a fool-ass move. Dang, that's how he doing it. TKA all day. <laughs> you know how we do, bringing you the tea every day, all day. Have a good night, guys. Hey, I'm at my mom's house and you won't believe what I found. All these old behind CDs and mixtapes from a billion years ago. Hey, you got my favorite one in there? You mean the one you made thinking it was Usher's greatest hit? Oh, wait, you know, that's my OG, the GOAT, the greatest, the legend, Gush Raymond. Ew, fanboy. Remember you used to pop, lock, and dance under the fire hydrant, pretending it was rain? Oh, uh, please don't act like I was the only one acting crazy. I can't even count how many times I heard you butchering that boy is mine. <laughs> and still, after all these years, you still ain't picked a side. And we are not having this conversation tonight. And don't be mad because your dad banned Lil' Kim and Foxy Brown once he heard them lyrics. Uh, there's a whole lesson on temptation. Well, thank God he never caught you doing your LL impersonation. <laughs> oh, I could still do it. <laughs> Bye. I'm not impressed. Anyway, do you remember the first one that we made? Of course I do. Will and Sade Volume 1. I'm looking at it right now. And guess what I just picked up? Brandy. Seriously? Always on my mind. That was always in heavy rotation. But how'd you turn a joyful song into a mournful song? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Yeah, you know, that was around the time Grandpa died, so... Just was always listening to that one all the time. Everybody else drifted in their own little weird world. It was, it was the only one who leaned in. That's what best friends do. Enough reminiscing. I gotta go, though. All right. Bye. Bye. Look at the drink that I'm on. All right, now don't forget, Braxton has the camera crew following us now, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. What's up, everybody? It's your boy, the big dog. Roddy Rob, baby. How you doing all my ladies out there? We all on the road. First tour stop, getting ready to get kicked off. And we're going to show some behind the scenes real quick. Keith Arrow, what's up? Baby, you looking good tonight. Hi. Oh, uh-huh. How you doing? Don't you have something better to do like your job? Well, Mommy, that's boring. Ladies and gentlemen, you already know. The one, the only, newest member of the team is Stacey G. I only go by one letter on her last name because she thinks she's a icon. I don't know who she's that from. Leave me alone. Oh, okay, so they take that phone real quick. Leave me alone. Hey, we're gonna say that for the tour, y'all. Look, look, we got so much going on. This man needs no introduction because legends let all their work to the talk. Yeah, all their loud ass managers. Boy, I'm on the phone. But that hurt, bro. But ladies and gentlemen, it's Will Clay. <laughs> Willie Will, baby, what's up, man? Tell the people the good news, man. Oh, yeah, the good news. So guess what? We decided as a team uh -huh. that we're no longer kicking off the tour at Madison Square Garden. We want to make a full circle move. Full circle? So what we started off at? Right here in Philly. Philly, baby. So y'all want to make sure y'all grab tickets, man. This is a big homecoming show for me. And I'm at Stacey. She in on it. So y'all want to get y'all tickets, all right? Let's go, baby. Y'all already here first. They're coming back home, oh, baby. Get y'all right, tickets. Turn it off. Let's we got go. work to do. Okay. Ladies, give me a call. Okay? Hey, turn it off. Kiera, are you happy? Yes, I am.
Okay, Stacy G. That's what I'm talking about. I see you in here rehearsing with your little blue jacket on. Have you ever done a real dress rehearsal before? Yeah, but not really with all these cameras around. That's a Kiara thing. She got this thing. Will, everything needs to be documented. Document this. Kiara, what's up? You like this? Kiara, this is for you. No, but I'm so proud of you, though. Seriously, I know you're about to rock this tour. Oh, thank you so much. You know, I was so nervous, but what? you've been such a great coach. Like, for real, my G, you're pretty good for an old head. Oh, so now I'm old. <laughs> wow. Dang, listen, Stacy, I knew it was something special in you the moment I saw you. Now the whole world about to see you. We starting this tour off in Philly, so you know what that means. You about to be singing at one of the cities where the dopest music came out of. Oh, man, I remember being a kid in Philly, sitting at Fairmount Park, Singing, writing, dreaming, hoping for moments like these. Hmm. Wow. We haven't met here in years. This used to be our spot back in the day. So many memories around here, man. The bridge, the water. Now we used to have some good times out here. Well, somebody's in a good mood. Dress rehearsals must be going nicely. I guess. It's just... I don't know how I feel about leaving this all behind so soon. You know, ever since I've been here, I've just been focused on me. I ain't had no time to get up with you and see how things are going with you. Mm, I'm good, Will. The record store has been busy 24-7, so I really haven't had much time for anything else. So you ain't got a man? Yeah, Jesus. <laughs> you know what I mean. Come on, Shada, you special. You're beautiful and... Intelligent and successful businesswoman. I mean, I just feel like the dude's gotta be knocking your doors down. Yeah, knocking my doors down, but I'm just not interested. Mm. Mm. Well, since you're so nosy and interested, how about you find me somebody? Oh, nosy? Yes. Wow, man, I was just looking out for you, trying to make sure you find a good one. Uh huh. Speaking of, I actually know somebody. Oh, really? Yeah, you know they say he's super fine. Uh huh. Super musically inclined. Wow. And, and always on time. <laughs> like, ay, ay, ay. Uh, yeah, I can't yeah, yeah. with you. <laughs> see, this is the world I love and I wish the world could see. Cute, goofy knucklehead. Ah, uh, you think I'm cute? <laughs> Come on, at least you know I could be real with you. So what about your fiance? <sighs> yeah, I don't really know what that is these days. Hmm. Mm. Tell me you remember when we wrote The Life right here. Of course, but do you remember the original harmony? Of course I do. What was it? I want the life. When we wrote that song, I'm not gonna lie. I thought things would be a lot different. You know you don't have to settle. It's not too late to make it right. Nick, 
Cool. All right. Let's run it one more time, and then we'll add the music once uh, the rest of the dancers get here. <sighs> All right, five, six. Five, six, almost made you break your neck. Uh, ha, ha, uh, uh. Ooh, girl, this ain't just sex. Uh. Nah, 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 I'm sorry. Now, y'all look good. Y'all look real good, but I need to talk to Kiara real quick. Yo, Key. What's the problem? I, I can't do it with this vest. Like, I, I know you want to make the decisions. I even let you have these cameras and stuff in here, but come on, it's got to be another option other than this because sparkles, that ain't the aesthetic I'm going for. No, shut up, Will. You look fine. Stop being overly dramatic, okay? I know you want to be your own man and dress yourself, but less thinking, more singing, okay? Leave the decision making to me. What you trying to say, I can't make my own decisions? What? I am not having this conversation right now, okay? This is not the time or the place for you to have a temper tantrum. Rehearse and follow the formula, all right? I'm not talking about this right now. We're not talking about this right now because I'm sick no, of you trying to run not. stuff. You know, seriously, you got to start listening. Right. This is what I'm, I'm making the money. Yelling, yelling. Yelling, what's going on? We gotta get this rehearsal going. Stacy G is exactly. waiting. Exactly, thank you. Talk to him, please. All right. Oh, what's going on? Man, don't even worry about it. Just, where the rest of the dancers at? They ready to teach the routine. Oh, yeah, about that. He thought two should be enough, right? Nigga, I want a 10 for the aesthetic. I, what I'm gonna do with just two? Y'all didn't think to ask me that? You know you always dance so great, lovely lady. Good rehearsal. I'm about to check in with sound real quick, and uh, we'll um, clean up some more choreo. Yo, Jamie, real quick. I'm not liking the way my vocals are sounding. Can you add some more reverb when we get over in the room? Uh, yeah, first off, you sounded great. Uh, Kiara told me not to add any more reverb. No, no, no. Cool. Kiara don't got nothing to do with the way I sound. I do. So go over there and add some more reverb like I asked. Got it? Yes, sir. Cool. Okay. Also, while you're at it, can you talk to the lighting designer? The, the, the lights ain't doing nothing for me. They got to dance. We need, like, some kobolds or some movers or something. Can y'all do something about this? I don't want to be combative. Uh, Kira told me I can't make any set design changes without her prior approval. Mm. She said she has to prove everything. No, no, no. Excuse me? Kiara said what? Will, I'm baby! <laughs> Listen. I'll get right on that for you. So, yeah, about that. Kiara thought we should change that, too. Yo, Ronnie, you my homie, but you got to start realizing who pays who here. 
All right? Okay. When I ask somebody to do something in my rehearsal, I want to hear, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Got it, sir. Got it, sir. My pleasure, sir. My pleasure, sir. I'm sick of hearing all this goddamn Kiara said, Kiara said, this is my show. Yes, sir. And if y'all can't implement that, then y'all can both fit the door. And I mean that, bro. I don't want to hear any dealing with this shit no more. Okay. I'm sorry. What? I'm sorry. Well, no one's begging you to be here, okay? Stacy G is ready. No. <laughs> You two are hilarious. No, 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 chill, right? right. No. What you mean, Stacey G ready? This is my show. I mean that this show is going to go on with or without you. I just wonder what your fans are going to think when they find out that their little favorite artist backed out because he didn't get his way. Man, fuck them fans. And this dumbass show is deeper than that, and you know it, Kiara. You've been trying to control and manipulate my career with your analytics and all your formulas since day one, but guess what? You can't recreate God-given talent. Oh, please. That's right here. Some new ass I never know nothing about. Kiara, what you gotta realize, this is a thousand for you. Yeah, no, never. But it's only one of me, oh, and he, I mean that. He didn't mean that, Yes, he did. If you think that you can make it without me, go right ahead. But don't you dare come running back when everything falls apart. <laughs> well, she didn't mean that, bro. <laughs> what you doing? Hey, Keith. Fuck you. <laughs> well, Will, we can fix this. Will! Will! Rodney, he's washed. We've got Stacey, and she is the future. Let's go. <sighs> <sighs> Like, I really hope he takes his pompous ass and stops alienating folks and talking about his fans. Like, give the younger artist a chance instead of sabotaging his own career. But his new music, it's kinda good though, so I'ma still listen to the album, even though he a jerk. <clears throat> you done with him? I ain't got no words, nothing, nothing, nothing. I have nothing left to say. Mm, I guess for next time on TK.
Hey, I'm fine. Open the door. I need to know you're all right. Uh, then let me in. You're scaring me. I don't want you to see me like this. Will, if you don't open this damn door, I'm going knock it off the damn hinges. <sighs> Did you just kick my door? Mm-hmm. So are the rumors true? No. <sighs> What is all this? <sighs> so you're going to drown yourself in your sorrows? Sade, look, I'm done. I'm done with music. I'm done with the business, everything. Look, newsflash, I ain't perfect. I tried to be. But people mess up every day. Well, ain't nobody perfect. But I'm not going to let you sit here and sink yourself into a depression. So you need to get up, clean up, and just deal with your demons. It's so easy for you to say from the outside looking in. This is all I know. Everybody want to see another entertainer crash and burn, and I'm supposed to just lose it all? That's bullshit, Shawnee, and you know it. Well, don't get hyped with me. OK, I'm the only one looking out for your what with me, so. I'm sorry. You know I didn't mean it like that. My bad. It's cool. But don't let it happen again. Or I'm going to have to put hands on you like I did back in the day in drama class. Oh. You know I still can't believe you hit me, right? Of course, with that mouth of yours, you had it coming. Hey, <sighs> this is all a mess right now. I ain't talked to Kiera or Rodney since everything went down. Well, what about that dream you told me about? About you taking a break from being an artist and focusing on Stacey G? You got to let the Lord light the fire that's burning inside of you and just put it into your craft. It's funny. I forgot all about that. I've been so consumed with the world turning on wheel play. <laughs> See, you just needed a little Sade love. You're so special, Sade. I love you. Wow. Really? Oh, Key. Really, Will? Key, 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 listen. With her, I promise you, this ain't what it looked like. And I think I came over here to make things right with you. But no, you all up in here kissing on this bohemian looking bitch. I knew you wanted him all along. First of all, who you call a bohemian, you high class hoe? You've been using him all these years and now you want to act like you care? Please. Look, why you got to complicate things? Sade. Please, Sade. Sade! Go ahead, run! Run after her. You know you want to. I should have just stayed away from you. But you know what? You ain't nothing but a little boy in a grown-ass man's body. But you can go straight to hell with your country-talking ass with gasoline draws on. I'm done. Key. I'm done. Kiera. Kiera! Ah! <laughs> wow! Nigga, looks like somebody's having fun. And boy, you can't just be walking up at people's houses Me? like that. That's how niggas get killed. I'm drawing, you drawing, what is going on here? I thought you had somebody to do this for you. Nigga, you seen the way my career going right now, all right? I ain't heard from you in a long time, Mr. Manager. Well, <laughs> this just so happens I have been doing some cleaning of my own, except it consists of your shit and making deals. Yeah, all right. Yeah, um, listen, look on the bright side, buddy. You're trending. Every major network wants to do an interview with Will Clay. Ever since that stunt you pulled, <laughs> your value has skyrocketed. Ah. We should celebrate. We should celebrate. Let's go out tonight and to get you out of this mm -hmm. funk. Nah. Listen, man. I got $50,000 for a walk through at the Vesper. Yeah, you heard me. That's it. And guess what? I got some baddies in the car right now that's waiting for their chance to meet Will Clay, baby. Come on, big dog. Right, you know, right, come right, on. Right, right, right. I don't know, man. Not come tonight, on, bro. Not a good night, bro. <gasps> Kiara, she basically done with me. 
She didn't walk in on me kissing Sade too much. I know what? You. No, you kiss Sade. Yeah. You kiss Sade. Bro, chill. <laughs> Yo, yes, you kiss Sade. Bro, you got. Oh my God, hey. man! Check this out, man. Look, Kiara loves two things, and that's m -m -m money and you. Kiara ain't going nowhere unless the money talk. Now I say, let's just go to this club, do this walkthrough. And let's give her another 50,000 reasons to stick around. <laughs> you said 50K? 50K, yeah. Go boy. You seen the way my career going. Uh-huh. Can't leave that kind of money on yeah. the table. Oh, come on, baby. What give you me say? a second. Yeah. Let me get dressed. Yeah, let's go. Nigga, shut up. It's Willie Will, baby. <laughs> I love it, man. Look, I beat you outside, OK? Shut up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to be around some love tonight. Y'all riding? Let's get it. Oh, gee. Oh, man. Where y'all want to go tonight? Hey, 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 hey. Young boys. Young boys. Here, come here. Hey, man, take a picture of me the ladies. These beautiful ladies tonight, man. Look at them. It's really good tonight. Hey, say Rodney, baby. Rodney. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good looking young boy, man. Appreciate that, man. Me, hey, man, go buy yourself a bag of chips or something, man. Why, yo, what you doing with my car? Oh, this? Oh, <laughs> man, you gave me this a couple months ago, man. I didn't think you would miss it. Yeah. Where my keys at? Oh, they in the car, man. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, man. Let's go. Hello, what is your name? Ronnie. Ronnie? Huh? Nigga, why you drag me out the house and ain't nobody here? Come on. And more importantly, where the hell is my 50K? What? Nigga, stop playing with me. Where my money at? I'll be right back. Look who I find over here sitting lonely, man. What's good with you, bro? Oh, Molly Mall. What's good, bro, man? What you doing here? Man, nothing. Just looking for the shorties. Where they? Hey, man, I would buy you a drink, but you still drinking that whack ass beer. Yeah, bro, I'm confident. Is that Will Clay? Man, I'm surprised to see you out showing your face. Look, man, I really ain't in the mood for no bloggers, but good to see you, man. Will, everything good? Yeah, we good. Mr. Blogger, he was just leaving. Nah, we cool, fam. Yeah, we good. It's TKA, man. They, they, they do the most. Just thought that you'll be in protective custody or something like that. That's all. Protective <laughs> custody. <laughs> I know you love for me to just crawl into a hole and die, but, but nigga, I'm here. See, when you reach God status like me, take more than one bad show to warm my reputation. Nigga, you drunk. <laughs> Talking about God status. You obviously haven't seen the charts lately. That comeback album? <laughs> shaping up to be a major flop. Flop? You think because I'm famous this shit don't affect me? Money don't make dealing with shit easy. You see, y'all think y'all know everything in the blogs, but y'all don't know a goddamn thing. If you thing. can't take the heat, then get out the kitchen. There's millions of people that'll trade places with you. Don't act like you ain't blessed, my nigga. I'm sick of this nigga. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, listen. This is not the time or the place. Look, come on, let's go. This is a setup. Take this out. Oh, let's get no, but we can't just let people think they can run up on us. Yo, school this nigga. Yo, man, yo, and just to be very clear, I am blessed beyond measure. But see, what y'all in the media don't understand is that when you put on a pedestal by all these people, you, you do all type. Them, you treat them like shit and take their money, huh? Come on, dog. Braxton, baby, Braxton, baby. Listen, I'm sorry I had to dip off real quick. Yeah, but listen, I just wanted to let you know <laughs> the plan is in motion and TKA is on the way, okay? Excellent. <laughs> you three for three, you know that, right? I know, stop, man. Listen, all right, baby, now I gotta go because it's getting crazy in there, okay? All right, talk to you later. All right, I'll talk with you. Come on, dog. That entitled celebrity card is played out. You ain't been right since your grandfather died. No, nah, yo, I ain't got nothing to lose. I will kill this Ma, nigga. Ma, we good. Let's just get out of here before this get any worse for this clown. Nah, this cool. I got what I need. Yeah, get your ass out of here. All right, what, 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 what the hell you been? 
secure the bag, man. Nigga, don't touch me. I'm out. Get back the best way you can. Scary. That's okay. Let it out. We know we did you wrong. I just tried to stand up for him, you know, be everything that he needed. But I guess that just wasn't enough. But I was the one taking all the L's. You know, I was the one picking up the pieces and rearranging them, you know, making sure that he looked good at all times. But I guess for somebody like William Clay Gregory III, that just wasn't important enough. I mean, at the end of the day, the money's what talks, right? Wow. So, did you know that he was cheating on you with Jordan Holmes? You know, Jay, I didn't want to believe it. But me being me, I believed him when he said that it wasn't recent. You know, I didn't have any reason not to. So I took his word for it and I kept it moving. You know, that's what black women do. Sounds like you were something special, a real rider. I mean, that's how I was raised, you know, with honesty and integrity. <laughs> the only good thing that came out of this situation is that Rodney and I was able to start our own label. And we were able to sign an amazing artist, Stacey G. You know, I got an awesome partner, an awesome artist, out of an unfortunate and horrible situation. I know that's right. Now, what we really want to know is, did you get the bag from his lying ass? <laughs> Let's just say I am not the unfortunate one, okay? Well, let me be the first to say congratulations on your new label and project. Thank you so much. Tell us some more about what you got going on. My pleasure, Jay. So our label is No Mercy Records. And the first artist to be released is Stacey G. And her first single is titled Should Have Known, which is actually my story with Will. You know, somehow... Stacy was there to witness some of the horrible things that he and I went through. And her being such an amazing artist, she was able to capture some of that raw pain and emotion that I had gone through and was able to put it into the song. Oh, so y'all like Jermaine Dupree and Usher with the confessions? I mean, I hadn't thought about it, but you can say that. All right. Now, we definitely have a special treat for our listeners. First, let's get into this new Stacey G song, and maybe after the commercial break, we can get into some more tea about Will Clay and his retirement announcement. Maybe. Rod, talk to me. Rod. Bro. Please tell me what I just saw in that interview ain't true, bro. Please tell me. You ain't steal my artist and start a label with Kiera? Well, bro, what's up, man? It's been a minute. How you doing? A minute? Nigga, you stole my artist? Bro, calm down, man. It's just business. It's just business. Nigga, you stole my artist. Are you serious? He's supposed to be my manager. He's supposed to be my brother. Uh, listen. Well, once the label offered you the new deal, and you turned it down, idiot. What was I supposed to do? Keep my career in your hands. Fight for me, dog. You ain't never heard of that? You were supposed to fight for me. Well, listen. The only, only time that I throw my hands up is where the money is. And right now, the money is well, game. Y'all, y'all some money hungry. Blood sucking, energy sucking hoes. Look, I'm good. Yo, big dog, bro, 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 get your money. I'm good. 
get your money, but I promise on everything I love, nigga. I'ma let the whole world know how much of a weak ass, goof ass, pussy ass nigga you are, and that's on everything I love. Ah, uh, <laughs> listen, I gotta go, man. I'll see you later, all right? It's good talking to you. Get off my line, nigga. been trying to reach you for weeks. There's been a huge problem. What the hell happened now? God damn. I was looking through your accounts and noticed a lot of inconsistencies, and your taxes haven't been paid either. No, no, no. I sign a check every month. Kiara and Rodney's supposed to be paying that. Come on, man. Just, you got this wrong. You need to talk to Kiara and Rodney. I see the checks have been cashed, but they were made out to a company called I.R.S. Looks like a shell company. Since you didn't make arrangements and you haven't returned my calls for a month, the feds are going to be here. Yeah, you're home tomorrow morning to seize your property. <laughs> Will. Will? You okay? Are you there? Will! Stay at my Look, say no more. Just, just let me know when you're on your way. I appreciate you. All right, man. Don't worry about it, your brothers. Hey, <sighs> right. um, I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see you in a few. All right, bet. on my couch for five days. What, what you doing? I know, bro. Uh, actually, it's finna ask you to take me somewhere. The game about to come up. Yeah, I know, but it's time for us to pull up on that weak, fat ass, goofy ass, riding ass nigga. Oh yeah, definitely. Look, it's on site for that nigga. But man, it's still crazy, bro. I can't believe them niggas was playing me. Yeah, man, Kiara. Scheming, man. So that's wild. Shit's wild. All right, look, this is what we gonna do, right? You gonna shower, okay? You musty. Nigga, I am, man. Bro, bro. That's my natural deodorant, bro. Look, look me in my eyes, bro, bro, you musty. I'm team natural, bro. You smell like it's... pit bull. You said I smell like a dog? <laughs> I smell like a dog? <laughs> Say shit, man. Look, I'm gonna get you some towels, I'm gonna get you some Febreze to spray Nigga, your breath. Nigga, listen to me, though. Please don't tell Sade and Ty, bro. I'm not gonna tell Sade and Ty. Nigga, promise me. Um, I promise you, I'm not gonna tell Shark. I'm so anxious. Can we try it? Nigga, out? I told you not to tell her. When you with me, baby, Bruh. you're the safest. You knew I was gonna tell her. Come on, we all been together since day one. Don't act like 
Oh, it's just, I don't want you going to jail for some shit we finna do. This nigga go to jail. You too pretty to go to jail. We had you back then, and we got you back now. We go back like CD players and car seats, too thick and thin. So can y'all please stop playing Let's Be Out? I'm ready to put hands on it. Hey, well, you heard the woman. Let's go, bro. I'm ready for stuff. Let's do it. I'm about to King Griffey is here. Okay. What up? Next key, <laughs> yeah. I've been in the studio with her all week and she just been body and everything thing she touch. Woo! Well, keep doing what you're doing because it's working. This next single needs to be her mom. We need to make sure all the right DJs okay. and hosts are getting paid to play this record. Right. We need a Billboard hit. Listen, let me handle the marketing. You handle the finances. And now that we got everything under control, the bag is flowing directly to us, baby. <laughs> You think you are so smart, <laughs> Stop <don't> it. <laughs> listen, listen, baby. You know I knew it would always end up like this, right? Mm. To me, mm. you, mm. without him. Rashon gave him all that bread once we took Will now, mm. right? <laughs> Give me some sugar, baby. <laughs> Give me some sugar. Oh, Snake ass nigga, was it worth hey, it? Listen, was it worth it? What are you talking about? Man? Nigga, what? you heard me? Boss! What are you doing? Screwing me Get over? Tearing up everything we built? Man, my career? Whoa, you! Wow! Now hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Everybody just calm down. Will! Will! Get off of me. Man, we can talk about this situation and fix everything, man. Get now listen. Oh my God. Man, we can go back to how everything was, right, Key? Are you, are you crazy? Someone huh? get her off of me now! Will, look, bro. We can just go talk in private. Talk in private to so what, Rodney? We all know you a Rodney nigga. Whoa, oh, listen, listen, I'm not. I'm not. Whew. I'm not, listen. Well, look. I'm telling you, come join us, man. Be a, be a part of what we've been building, man. We'll give you ownership just like you always wanted. <clears throat> can I please crack this nigga nah, head? Nah, nah, you good. Actually, it depends. I'm going to get my money back, Rodney. Yeah, nigga, I know about all of it. The lying and scheming and plotting behind my back? I figured you might want to handle it my way before I took it to court. You, you know what? You're right. You're right. Okay, this is too much. Man, I ain't this giving him nothing. Whoa. Johnny, Whoa. shut the hell up. Will, you're going to get your money as soon as possible. Oh, sure. Dang. Oh, man, you got some damn sense. I should have beat your ass a long time ago. Man, I ain't got that kind of money just laying around anywhere. God. You got five days, right? What? Five days. We gotta pull up back around here. I'm gonna let my boy Molly Maul do what he do. Look, 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 look. man, it ain't gonna be necessary, all right? Listen. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, man. Like, I know we were supposed to be brothers, but I saw an opportunity and I had to take it, man. Look, man, I hope we can move on from this, right? <laughs> Nigga, you weak as hell and you bald head as hell. Let's go. You good, baby? Let's go. Oh, and you with the trash bundles. Yeah, okay. If you wasn't happy, that's all you had to tell me. Just keep it real. We both knew we wasn't going to make it. <laughs> I'm just surprised you ended up with that nigga. Have a nice life. Yo, and Stacy G, you see the kind of people you're dealing with? Congratulations. You have officially played yourself. Let's go, y'all. Just what are you doing? I've got insurance. I'm out. I don't want nothing to do with Oh, you can't leave us. I have you under contract. I'll sue you. Try me. Uh. <sighs> Whew. Oh, for real, key. I thought I was about to die, baby. Uh-uh. Nigga, this ain't gonna work. Baby, don't do that to me. I'm Rodney, baby. Chow, Will Clay was not playing. That's exact. That was some five heartbeat stuff, first of all. That's how Bird should have ran up on Big Red when Rodney looked up. He looked like he saw a ghost. Man, if somebody stole my money, slept with mm. my girl, and then gave certain media members dirt. Mm, all your dirt. And I'd have beat that ass, too. And you can tell Will was emotional from the rip. Hold on, did you just give an exclusive without giving an exclusive and you glossed over that little thing a little bit? Hey, it Sounds should be. Sounds like you just <laughs> gave up your source. It should be public knowledge by now. Mm. I mean, 
At least every news outlet know that all you have to do is give your boy Rodney a bag for some dirt on the clay can. Damn. But they have been doing my man's foul all this time. Speaking of, did you see this GoFundMe for Kiara's bundles? Oh, I did. <laughs> Yo, they did your girl dirty, man. Yo, they did, man. Whoever that girl was dragged her. Bow. I know you seen the meme. Wow. Stop, Sade. I think that's the girl name. Sade. Is that like Sade? Sade? Yeah, okay, that's that hood version. But you can't help but see them. Like, those are the type of friends that you need. The ones that's going to ride or die for you when people do you wrong. True. You know what? I've been a little harsh. A little bit. I'll give him a pass for this one. Hopefully. You, know, you think I should give him a pass? Please give this man a pass. He's been through enough. I'm going to tell you why I'm going to give him. I'm going to give him a pass okay. because I like how he took it back to the streets on this case. He, you know he ain't from nobody's streets. Hey. He looked like he was. <sighs> <sighs> All right, that's enough. TKA, it's your girl, Moni. And it's your boy, Justin. Listen, we give you all the tea all day, every day. See you next time on TKA. We out. <laughs> Man, that big old bowling ball oh, wow. rolling through. Bowling when ball. you hit him with the left, bow! That's a big body nigga right there. I'm talking, man. It's like David and Goliath. Yo, bro, I had your back, though. I already know. Mm -hmm. How about your girl, Kiara? Sure thing. Sure thing, get over it. Me. Yo, girl. Yeah, see them cheap bundles she had in her head. <laughs> Yo, I love y'all. Facts. I love y'all, too. So are y'all sure y'all can't stay? Mm. Tile, just cancel and hang out with us. Mm. No, I wish I could, but I can't. All right, well, look, we're going to do a squad dinner next week with Spades. Yeah. All right? Molly Ma, Tile can't stay, but come on, you trying to hang out with us tonight? Man, after I drop him off, I got to run to my baby mom house. Here we go. Here we go with the baby mom. she love to hate a baby pop. Oh, oh my man. gosh. Okay. Look, but that Spade game do sound good. So they set it up. Mm -hmm. Y'all so lazy. Yeah, why, why she always got exactly. Get out my car, boy. Go. No. Can you feel the love wow. tonight? And finally, y'all two stop acting like y'all ain't love each other since y'all was ten years old playing catch a girl, freak a girl. <laughs> First of all, bro, you trifling. Second of all, it's timing. You know that timing is everything, mm -hmm. and it's finally the right time. I appreciate y'all too. Y'all pulled up. Y'all came through for a nigga today. I appreciate y'all. Helping me out, making it happen, getting that big nigga off, yes. getting my money back. Yes. Uh -huh. I owe y'all. Actually, you can keep that back as a present. Aww. You know, I love for these moments, right? My man. And someone's gotta keep you from ruining your career. <laughs> mm, that's true. Oh, um, actually I know how you can pay me back. What's up? I need. Gas and rent money because you stayed at my you. house last yeah. night. Boy, right, what you drove? I drove y'all. What, what you, you dumb as hell? Why Boy, you, you acting broke? Hell. You a goop ass man. Nigga, you rich. She, she, me. You oh, are yeah. rich. So what you want to do tonight? I got an idea. How about we write together like we used to do when we were teenagers? Really? Yeah. You want to write with me? I'm all rusty. Oh, stop, it can't be that bad. Let's, it'll be fun. Let's do it. All right. I'm gonna drive you right. <laughs> Man, I, I haven't written like this in so long. Look, I miss this well. It's us having fun, writing, singing. <laughs> it's like the good old days. Pack of wing have no cares in the world. Just family, fun, and friends. <laughs> Running through the streets, broken pencils, torn up notebooks from writing so much. Yeah, we used to run the streets so much together. <sighs> ah, if only we could catch that lightning in a bottle like you always wanted. And nothing's better than this moment right here, right now. That energy we used to have, that chemistry. I think we can get that back. It was so raw, so honest. I don't know. Are you still a wild child at heart? <laughs> Are you willing to explore, love, cry? Maybe. Honestly, Shade, I feel like with you by my side, I can do anything. Well, I'm gonna always be by your side, even on your bad days. But you gotta promise me one thing. What's that? You gotta do some therapy, okay, so that you can love you right. That means loving you, right? I'm all in.
You're scared, aren't you? You could tell. You're shaking. Hey, we got, I don't know what to say to him. You gotta think about it. You know, I've been holding this in for a long time. You acting like you were tortured as a kid. Oh, come on. You know my mom and them don't gotta torture you to put the fear of God in you. It'll be okay. If you say so. Let's do it. Your mama's on her way back home, and I need some help with that honey do list. Listen, knock off them dishes for me, okay? Come on, we just got here. Man. I know, I know. Thank you. It's good to see you. Oh, oh, hey, Will. Knock that toilet off for me, son. Wow. That's how you gonna do me that? That's my scion. Come oh, on. Oh. Come on, young lion. Wow, Dad. Get to work. <laughs> good to see y'all. Good to see you. Yeah, I told you I could drive this. Uh -huh. Ain't that, you know? Come on. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. There's been a lot going on. Mm -hmm. You look good. Y'all hungry? I'm yes. gonna make some dinner. You need any help? Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> you gonna make that fried chicken I love? You always want fried chicken. You know it. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm finna be with Pops. Okay. Well, you can get that flour out of the cabinet. Okay. <laughs> Smoked paprika is the secret ingredient, okay? I don't I just, think so. I just cooled you into family secrets. Uh Y'all did y'all thing, but where the pies at? Man, what y'all doing here? How'd y'all even know we were here? Yeah. I don't get no love? Looks like you already got enough. Wow. Anyway, his mom posted on Facebook like she always do. <sighs> so I slid in her DMs. You slid in my mom's DMs, bro? Slid. Mm -hmm. Your mom needs to stay off of Facebook. I've been trying to get off Facebook. Y'all know she got an IG now. Please Bruh. do not follow her. <sighs> but actually, since y'all here, we're trying to hit this space game or what? Let's go. So I'm talking about, hey, we did teach you how to play space at the cookout, right? Don't, uh, how you gonna play me like that? <laughs> my bad, Y'all don't want none of these Y'all don't want these Here you go. Come on, y'all corny. That's my partner. Y'all corny. <laughs> 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 it's not from the bottom, now we're here, y'all. You young bucks just can't hang with us. Uh-huh, this is 40 years of experience talking. Oh, oh it's basically telepathic now, baby. Mm -hmm. <laughs> one more game. One more game. Come on, we just need one, one more. more game. I know one we more. are in here with the victory. You know, no faces, son. Y'all lost. <laughs> Face it, Dad. We gonna have y'all number next time. <laughs> yeah, okay. okay. We'll see about that. Maybe next time you can call before you show up. Oh, <laughs> that was cold, Dad. Okay. All right. <laughs> Come on. Have a drink with your old man. <laughs> <clears throat> what? Spill it. The tea, honey. I want all the tea. I want the 20. And I want the celestial seasoning, the traditional medicinals. I want all of it. I guess I'll spill it. Mm -hmm. Come on, son. Have a seat. Yes, sir. Ah. All right. Here's to you. Man, Pops, it feels good to be home. It feels good to have you back home again. I knew you'd be back here eventually. Can't lie to you. I've been running from this place for a long time, man. Just out of fear of what you and mom was going to think about me. Mm. So that's why you've been sending me the voicemail. Look, hey, I ain't bring you back here to, to scold you or to, to beat you down like they've been doing in the news. I really just wanted to look at you in the eyes. See if you've learned something. And you're ready for some real change now. I am. Man, I hurt a lot of people. I burned, I've been burned by people I love. But I'm ready. I think I'm ready to make that change. 
You think or you know? I know. Good. But whatever you've done in the past, you need to leave it there. All right? You taking responsibility for your actions. But you can't hold on to that, that guilt and shame that you're feeling because it'll, it'll eat you up inside. It'll destroy everything you touch. Now you gained the world. And now you experience what it's like to lose your soul. It's time to let Jesus restore it for you, rebuild it. We didn't pour all that word into you when you were growing up just for you not to have it available to you when you needed it the most. Dad, man, you, you don't even know how relieved that makes me feel. Because I've been ashamed of myself. People pleasing and, and projecting a false image. I thought because I wasn't from a bad area or didn't have bad parents that I had to make this image like just to make people like me. Listen, son, you need to take pride in the fact that you didn't do that. And know that we're behind you no matter what. Even when you act like a heathen. <laughs> <laughs> Pops, I love you, man. Hey, I love you too, Will. I love you too. <laughs> Listen to me. Don't play with that girl's feelings. She really loves you. Yeah, I knew that other girl wasn't no good. Oh, oh here they go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> girl. Hey, baby. <laughs> All right, you know what? It's time to go to bed and let these two young people have some time to themselves. Mm hmm Yeah, it's our bedtime, so. Uh. <laughs> Y'all be good. Love you, Mom. Love you, too. All right, Mom. Love y'all. Pops. You. Love you, man. Enjoy each other. But not too much. <laughs> all right, all right. Still on her. <laughs> okay, I'll go on upstairs now. All right. Creek on up. So do you feel better? Let's just say you were right. Mm -hmm. It was a good idea. Oh yeah, oh yeah. This pillow been in the family since World War Three. <laughs> So what did you and your dad talk about? What did you and my mama talk about? Mm -hmm. It's confidential. Oh, man, it's confidential. Mm -hmm. We doing that? Yeah, we doing that. That's how you feel? Yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. Off to a bad start. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. You smell that, baby? Yeah, what is that? Mm-mm. I need some more Happy Pods, too, after I'm done with this. Ew, y'all stink. Y'all loud. Shut up. Come on, Mom. We might have a problem with your tongue. Nigga, shut up. You know good and well ain't nothing finna change between us, so relax, bruh. Lies, nigga. Y'all two about to mess up our whole group dynamics we got wow. going on. But I'm happy for y'all. Y'all <laughs> cute. Will, are you really retired? I ain't even gonna hold you, I don't know. You know, I might just wanna spend some time with my friends and family and some special people. But what I do know is that if I get back into business, it's gonna include ownership this time. I'm talking owning my own label, owning my own masters, and getting all my publishing. I ain't trying to have y'all coming to fight for me again. I got one question for you. Let me manage you. See, this is why I don't take you serious, come on. I just like, need 35%. 35. Bro, stop playing with me. I know the last time you were here, we got into a little tiff, but I know you're a changed man. And I'm so excited that you're here today to perform your new song. I was really curious what the inspiration was for this one. I'd say the inspiration for this song was um, the woman who made it her standard that I love me right so that I can, in turn, love you right. Sade, my wife, I love you. And this song I do tonight is dedicated to you. He's no stranger to the stage, and he's arisen from the ashes a brand new person. He'll be performing his hot new single, Love You Right. Give it up for Will Clay.
Thank you.